Hello, kids. Today, we're going to have some fun and learn about the sizes of different animals. In front of us, we have two adorable animals, a hippo and a puppy. But, which one is bigger? Let's take a closer look and find out. This is a hippo. Hippos are one of the biggest animals that live in the water. They are huge and strong, and this little cutie is a puppy. Puppies are small and usually fit into our arms, so what do you think, kids? Which one is bigger, the hippo or the puppy? That's right. The hippo is much bigger than the puppy. It's so big that you can't even imagine how enormous it is. Now, let's all tip the hippo, because it's the bigger one. Great job, everyone! In front of us, we have two different leaves, a banana leaf and an apple leaf. But, which one is smaller? Let's investigate. In our next adventure, we have a picture of a squirrel and a cow. But which one is smaller this time? This is a banana leaf. Banana leaves are large and wide, perfect for serving food or making beautiful crafts. And this tiny leaf is an apple leaf. Apple leaves are much smaller compared to banana leaves. So, what do you think, kids? Which one is smaller, the banana leaf or the apple leaf? That's right. The apple leaf is smaller than the banana leaf. It's a tiny little leaf. And this big animal is a cow. Cows are much larger compared to squirrels. They are gentle and give us milk. Tick the smaller tire. The smaller tire is the one on the left. Its size is small compared to the tire on the right. Tick the smallest tree. Tick the biggest animal. The biggest animal out of a puppy, elephant, and cat is the elephant. Please tick the elephant to indicate that it is the largest among these animals. Tick the smallest fruit out of mango, cherry, and watermelon. The smallest fruit out of mango, cherry, and watermelon is the cherry. Please tick the cherry to indicate that it is the smallest among these fruits. Tick the biggest bubble. You have three pots stacked on top of each other. Tick the pot on the top. Top, the pot that is physically the highest in the stack. It's the one that you would see first when looking at the stack from the outside. Middle, the pot that is sandwiched between the top and bottom pots. It's neither the highest nor the lowest in the stack. Bottom, the pot that is physically the lowest in the stack. It's the one that you would see last when looking at the stack from the outside. 